Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Scarlett and today I want to tell you about the free ebook that I am releasing. It is my fit bikini plan, bikini body guide um, for those who want to gain some muscle while also losing fat. I know people would say it's impossible, but I think it's really it's a good program for you if you want to lean out a little and while also maintaining the muscle mass and that's what I did last summer and it really worked for me so yeah I will be releasing it tonight and I will be posting the link for you to sign up for that and get your free bikini body guide in the description box below so yeah check it out so I want to start off by explaining some things if you have read through and you know even if you haven't read through I'll want to tell you about what to expect from this guide how long it is so the length of this program it for is for eight weeks so basically I divided the training into four different types of styles for training. The first one is stability, endurance, hypertrophy, and power. The reason I do endurance is for those who just want to get started or who are like really new to a program. I think it's really beneficial for you to help you build that strength and help you build the endurance to do the other more difficult moves and then of course I hypertrophy is for anyone who wants to maintain that muscle then you will definitely need hypertrophy and then I also did some stabilization well that's the first step because stabilization I feel like it really has helped me as a lifter for any different of any different um, levels even if you're an advanced I feel like stabilization would help you for making progress in your really big compound movement and I think that is would be really helpful for me as well um, for the bulking program that I am going through right now which I will be lifting heavier weights than before and then also the power I feel like power or plyometric training is really good if you want to just lean out and it does burn a lot of calories too and it's something def similar to hit like high intensity interval training because you are basically completing that certain amount of reps using explosive power movements and that really helps you build cal lose the calories while also helping you maintain that muscle so that's why I included it in this program and it is really self-explanatory um, you go through the moves for each week it is explained in that there will be two circuits for each workout session the first circuit has four and the second one also has four different exercises basically what you'll be doing is to complete the first four and then do a rest as mentioned in there and then repeat that for three times and then move on to the second circuit and then do it for two times so it could be something similar to circuit training but um, basically um, for circuit training there's very little rest but for my program some of them focuses on endurance so there is little rest but for some of them they focus us on power and hypertrophy so you can take rest in between for like three minutes so yeah I am so happy because I worked too hard for this probably like a hundred hours or so I put in all the all my effort into this this weekend I had no break like came back from my full-time job and then like every hour that I have I've been putting this putting into this my little baby for like a month so yeah I am so proud of you and I can't wait to hear back your feedback and any problems that you have while doing that and I also want to know anything that I could help you to for your fitness like physical and aesthetic goals so yeah, it also has a handful of articles that I cited it for use for researching and I used it with the best of my knowledge to help you with your fitness goals to be half that bikini body lean and fit toned and muscular body. So I am so excited and now I am heading to the gym to do my booty workout.
Before a booty workout, I usually do those dynamic warm-ups and they are usually lunges or hip extension movements that I do from to the back to the front or to the sides. Usually in both angles and in all angles to help activate the glute muscles before the workouts later on. And you can usually do them with a resistance band too. For that, the main movements that I do are the hip thrusts. I do them three times a week because I am mainly focusing on the glutes again this bulking period. Um, usually the upper part of the butt, so these hip thrusts are really, really good in order to target the gluteus medius, which I am doing right now. Um, and I did them from 145 and going up to 225. My goal is to do eventually over 300 and who knows, maybe 400. Doing the hip thrust for like six sets, then I moved on to the single leg deadlift because I am focusing mainly on the lower part of the hamstring right here. Um, the lower part, excuse me, lower part of the glute, which I'm ex focusing on one day and the next day I would focus on to the upper part of the glute. That's why I divided them up. And for the single leg squat, I find it really helpful just to squat low down onto the chair. Just Put all your weight into the chair and come back up again, squeezing the glute on the top. So yeah, my glutes are burning. Because I do them for like three or four sets with little to no rest in between. And after that, I moved on to the these pull throughs. I just love them so much. They have helped me a lot too during the cutting period when I had no barbells. These are so good to activate the glute before a hip thrust movement too. And then moving on, then those cable walks which I find them really helpful to grow the side butt too. And I love this. It's an overall well-rounded booty workout. And last but not least, I did those jumps to put the resistance band around my back and then just jump them forward and also try to do some lunges. Um, did them for like three sets. I hope you guys enjoyed my booty workout and it was help it would be helpful for your glute sessions too right now i am heading to work don't have time to go to the bathroom because someone was using it and i don't have the patience to wait and so right now yeah i am just finishing up my lunch with loads of vegetables and some lentils that i put together with nutritional yeast and breadcrumbs they are so good so filling and it's going to last until the end of the day and until that I will have my personal training at night and then after that I'm going to head back and then finally eat dinner hopefully at around 8 or 9. So yeah I am slowly getting back into the bulk because I don't want to gain a lot of fat and this is reverse diet um, just going back from the cut to the bulk and so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. So now let's head to work. And I hope you guys have a wonderful week. <laughs>